hello and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you how i fry turkey wings turkey wings turkey wings turkey wings better than baked okay so first in order to get started i'm going to clean my turkey wings inside my bowl here i have a little vinegar i'm sorry a little lemon juice and a little water and a little kosher salt I'm going to open up my package and get my turkey wings in there. Yes, I am wearing gloves because I have five children and one of them needs something at any moment. And I don't have to just break out of gloves and, and, and you know, I don't have to just stop and wash my hands and do whatever. I could just take off the gloves, do whatever, and get me a fresh pair of gloves and finish fix, fixing whatever I'm fixing. So I'm going to get all my wings in here and get them clean. I'm going to check for feathers. I'm going to make sure all that slick slimy is off of them. Um, and just make sure they're all ready for me to get boiling so I can get them fried for dinner. So here's my wing after I've cleaned them. As you can see, no feathers. All those little teeny tiny feathers that's usually on the tip of the wing are all. Okay, so now you can see why I clean my meat. There's this film, this gooky nasty stuff that comes off of the meat when you clean it that I don't want in my system or my family system. So this is what my meat looks like after I've rinsed it several times. Now I'm going to get my water seasoned and flavorful so I can boil them. So I have a four quart pot here and it's halfway filled with water. I'm going to sprinkle in a little Creole seasoning just for the flavor. I'm also going to add in a couple of shakes of red crushed pepper and a little sprinkle of garlic powder and about two tablespoons of kosher salt um, just for the flavor like I said I'm not putting too much um, like the meat's not going to come out salty with the seasonings that I used um, I'm also going to use one packet of my Saison flavoring um, and that's going to give it a nice color and more flavors. Um, I just didn't want it to be salty because there's going to be a little bit of salt in the breading. So the meat won't be salty. It'll be nice and flavorful and the breading will have that, that little salt to it to add um, some seasoning to it. So I got my water all flavored up. I'm going to give it a nice stir. And then I'm going to get my turkey wings dropped in so they can start boiling. So my turkey is all ready for my pot, nice and clean as I showed you before. I'm going to get that in my water and get that boiling. So I'm going to boil it for a total of 25 to 30 minutes or until the turkey is nice and tender. Pretty much done as you will see here. So you can see my fork goes through nicely, the meat flakes it's nice and tender so I'm going to get my oil um, going and I'm going to get my breading going so my oil is getting nice and hot I have in a bowl here um, flour cornstarch and the seasonings that I used to um, boil my turkey meat in so there's no clashing flavors I'm going to get the meat out of the pot and dredge it in the flour and then I'm going to lay it in the oil to fry. So yeah you've already cooked it but you're frying it just to get some color on it now if you have tiny turkey wings that almost look like chicken wings there is no need to boil those before you fry those you can just fry those but you can see how large my turkey wings are so you can see i had to boil them before frying them so that they would remain tender um, you don't have to fry them long if they are teeny small turkey wings but if they are the big um, turkey wings boil them before you fry them if you don't boil them before you fry them you will end up with tough 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 turkey wings So after frying till they're nice and golden, here is my finished product. 
my beautiful golden crispy fried turkey wings thank you for watching please share comment like and subscribe